Hello, this is uh, Ken back with you for Tech for the Average Guy. And uh, what we're talking about today is going to be uh, home automation. Now, home automation can be and probably is different. What's ho what I like about home automation for me may not be features that you want for you. Um, this category is still, I believe, relatively new and within probably the next 12 months is going to be a, a pretty good shakeout. I mean, there have been a lot of players, large and small, who joined, who's jumped into this, this category. And um, some places, some people are going to, some of the products are going to go away. Uh, some are going to get swallowed up by other larger companies. And it's going to be hopefully some nice partnerships to, at the end of the day, they'll bring a product out or a series of products out that uh, we all can enjoy and look forward to using. Um, I'm excited about the field of home automation and I can't wait to see some of the new products that are going to be coming out in the coming year. Um, now I recently I purchased the uh, Wink Hub and two of their light bulbs. There was a special buy at uh, Home Depot where if you purchase two of the light bulbs, any two Wink control products, I chose the light bulbs, then you got the Wink Hub for 99 cents. Now, it's my understanding that the Wink Hub has both uh, Zigbee, Z-Wave, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth. It can handle all of those different signals. It has those atten antennas built into their hub. And as far as I can tell, that number of antennas in this price range is probably uh, your best value. It might not be the most powerful hub, But the number of antennas and the price, I think, is going to be one of the uh, most competitive products out there right now. Now, I've, I've also got uh, some Wemo uh, home control, home automation things. I think they come with the small little hub and, and, and a couple of light bulbs. Uh, TCP, I always get that wrong. I'll, I'll pop that up uh, as another home automation light bulb type of thing. So let's just take a look at uh, what I'd like to see and maybe you agree with me that uh, this would be a good marriage and that, did, that being the Amazon Echo which is a, a new product out uh, that has uh, some limited shipping. I'm still waiting on my Echo. It's an invite only product so I've asked for an invite and so now I'll have to sit back and wait I'd hope to have it in here, get an invite, and get that in here before Christmas to play with. So um, maybe there's still a small chance that that can happen. Anyway, the Amazon Echo you may be familiar with. If not, uh, there will be some links here and some references to it. Uh, but what I'd like to see is the Amazon Echo uh, paired up with the Wink Home Automation Hub and let those two products uh, control your house. I mean, this, this is how I envision to be the, an ultimate pairing, and uh, we all come out ahead. Anyway, let's just take a look. This is Homey. It brings the room it's placed in to life immediately. It connects to a whole range of devices, and it's controlled by your voice. Hey, Homey, I want to watch Star Trek. Would you like subtitles with that? Yes, subtitles, please. For On The Go, we designed an app with a very quick touch interface to control your home and with speech recognition for hands-free situations. Homie, preheat the oven please. Okay, your oven will be preheated when you're home. We made Homie intelligent, so it can take care of your home even without you interfering. Okay, so that's, uh, that's Homie. That was actually a Kickstarter project and it has been fully funded. And from what I can tell, it looks like uh, the release price, at least uh, right now, you're looking at about 280 US dollars to get that. Now, this was my first home automation product, probably a Wi Fi thermostat from Filtreat, but the uh, Wi Fi module eventually died on it after two years, so I replaced it with the Honeywell Lyric. And I've been pretty happy with the Lyric. I've only had it about a month, and uh, 
I think the software is going to improve over time. Uh, it's got a few minor things that are kind of annoyances, but the uh, hardware is looks rock solid. Some point I'd like to maybe add a, uh, a automated door lock, like the Quick Set, um, that you can unlock with an app, whether remotely. And of course, there's the uh, August door lock, which also looks interesting. So I'll investigate that one at some point, but that's not high on my list. There's even a Wi-Fi water heater, which uh, makes sense if you have a, a place that's a vacation home. You can kind of, as you approach the home, maybe you're a couple of hours away, you can just go ahead and turn the water heater up so that uh, you'll have hot water when you arrive, but you can turn it down when you're not there. So with the people at Amazon and the people at uh, Wink can get together, I mean, this is uh, what I envision uh, the product could be. You talk to Echo, Echo then relays the command over to the Wink hub, and from there you can control your thermostat, garage door, lights, door locks, and a host of other products that are either currently available or will be available soon. So instead of... Uh, for probably half of the price of, of investing in the other product that was shown earlier, we can use existing technology to accomplish the same thing. All it takes is a little cooperation. Let's get it done.